Welcome to the voice of the Lord. Our verse for today is in Matthew 23, verse 37. O Jerusalem, Jerusalem, you kill the prophets and stone those who were sent to you. How often do I wish that I could gather you like a hen gather her chicks under her wings, but you are not willing. These were the words of the Lord Jesus Christ when he looked at Jerusalem. Behind the friends is Jerusalem. And he was speaking, friends, uh, to the people, of course, of Jerusalem, saying that how I wish that I could gather you like a hen gather her chicks. You know why, friends? They were so stiff. They were so hardened in heart. And how the Lord Jesus Christ wished that they would just incline their ears to him, gathering them around him, that he may teach them his ways, that he may reveal unto them the plans of God. But they refused. They were not willing. In fact, they stoned the prophets and killed those that were sent to them to preach the gospel to them. So friends, let us not be like Jerusalem at the time where they were so stiff, they were so hardened in their hearts, they just refused to, uh, to listen to the Lord Jesus Christ. Today, listen to him. Amen. Let him allow you. Let him uh, gather you as a, a some mother hand gather her chicks under her wings, under her protective wing. So friends, we've been wanting to be touched by the Lord. You've been wanting to be blessed by the Lord. How else can we be blessed by the Lord? But surrendering ourselves to Him, allowing Him to to touch our lives, allowing Him to speak to us, to teach us His ways, that we may learn about Him, His plans, and His process in our lives. So friends. As mentioned, friends, we are here in the Mount of Olives in Jerusalem. And behind me is the old city. And, uh, you know, just imagine the Lord Jesus, Jesus Christ looking at this city at the time and saying that how I wish that you people over there can come to me. So today, friends, let's allow ourselves to be touched by the Lord, to be taught by the Lord by, in His ways and be blessed in the process. Amen. So may the Lord bless you, may the Lord keep you, may his face upon you and be gracious unto you. May he lift up his countenance on you and give you his shalom, his peace. God bless. See you again next time. Bye.